YouTube family. What is going on today with everyone, man? It is your boy, Jay the Sneaker Guy, coming at y'all today with a how I video, um, which is me showing you guys how I lace my Air Jordan 3s. So uh, thank you guys for all stopping through. Um, welcome to all the newcomers. If this is your first time stopping through, checking out any of the family's content, um, go ahead and join the family. But uh, before I even ask you to join the family, go ahead and uh, check out some of the, the previous content. See if you like it, man, which which we know you guys will, man. We, we do a lot of different things over here on this channel. But um, if you do like it, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Join the family, y'all. We are grinding over here, man. We are always trying to achieve different goals as well as different, you know, things on this channel. So uh, we will greatly appreciate it if you guys join the family. And in advance, welcome to the family. Um, shout out to all my day one subs as usual, man. Shout out to everybody in the Noted Gang that has gotten here first. Drop that comment as well as hit that like button. Um, thank you guys for all the support as usual, but um, I ain't gonna hold y'all up no longer. Let's get into this How I Lace My Jordan 3 video, y'all. So today in this video, I will be showing you guys two different ways on how I lace my Air Jordan 3s. One will be the loose, um, what is it, the loose? The loose way, I guess I can call it. The loose way, and then I'll be showing you guys the more tight way of pause. This is kind of sounding kind of weird, but uh, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna show you guys both those ways on how to do it. Um, pretty much the tighter way will be looking like this. Bam, this is my Air Jordan 3 Knicks. This will be the tighter way of how to lace Air Jordan 3s. And um, one way right there, and then bam too high this will be my loose way on how to lace my air jordan 3 so i'm gonna show you guys both those ways as far as how to lace those and um that'll be the vid y'all so let's go ahead and get to it starting off of course you want to start from the bottom up as you do with any other lacing um these laces are longer than your usual length, but I'm gonna show y'all how to do it with longer laces. We're gonna go ahead and start with our bottom hole all the way down here. And uh, it'll be the hole on the top, as you can see, going through it from the outside in. And as I say in all my How I Lace videos, the goal is to keep your laces flat. So in from the outside in, and we're doing the same thing on the medial side of the shoe from the outside in and uh, do that. You see, I got all this extra lace right here. Just leave that, uh, grab both of your tops of the laces as you can see I got the tips right here grab both of those line them up together line them up together make sure that they are both you know what I'm saying both same length grab both of them and pull them together pull them together pull them together and when you're getting close towards you know this little bit of area here you want to make sure that your laces are straight so as you can see Mines are straight, so I'm gonna continue to pull them through. Bam. Got my first lace put in there. So I'm gonna grab them now, bring them to the outside as far as like, because I had them hanging, as y'all can see, I had them going under it. Bring them back over to the top now. And with me holding the tips the same way like that and pulling them, I got the same length on my laces. So same lace length on both sides. You need to make sure that both sides are the same length when you're doing this. Uh, and we're gonna be going to the next hole now, the same top hole. Let me turn to the side so y'all can see. It's going to go, now we're going from the inside out. So second, hole right here on the top we're going from the inside out maintaining and you know keeping these laces flat so as you can see I got them flat right there 
I'm just pulling, making sure that they flat. Bam, got that one. Let me do the same thing to this side. Go from the inside out and I'm gonna keep it flat. As you can see, I'm holding it, making sure that it's flat, going all the way through. Bam, got that second one done. So now this is what my shoe looks like. As you can see, everything is flat. Got my first and second one complete. So you're only going from the outside in on your bottom hole. Everything else from there is going to be from your inside out. So we're gonna continue to do that. Uh, we're gonna go to this light blue area here. As you can see, that's the next hole. So we're gonna go from the inside out. Bam. All the while, we're gonna hold these laces right here and keep them flat. You gotta keep them flat. So make sure that you got your laces flat. Biggest thing is having them flat. As you can see, it is flat. Flat going through. So keep that going. Bam. Same thing for this one. From the inside, turn it this way. Inside out, pull that through, go all the way, and I'm gonna hold this, make sure that my laces are flat. Bam. All right, so my lace length still should be the same, as you can see. Still should be the same. Same lace length because I got you know the same tension being pulled through each hole, so whoa, whoa, we had a blurry moment, but yeah, same, same lace length, y'all. So we're gonna do that all the way up till we get to the top of this hole right here. I'm gonna do it real quick. Slide through there. Bam. Holding that, making sure my laces are still flat. We good there. Same thing with the last hole. So we got that right there. Going from the inside out. So this is where we are right now, as y'all can see. Everything is flat. Looking good, so far looking good. Sides, everything flat. Side, everything flat. So, all right, here. You see how much extra lace I got? All this extra lace. This is a lot of extra lace. All right, what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna go ahead and tweak up my, my shoe a little bit as far, because this is more of a tight look. This is how you can do a tight look. As far as when you're doing a tight look, all you gotta do instead of, let me, let me reverse a little bit y'all. Instead of going from the inside out, you would go from the outside in on your last, the top, the top hole. This top hole is what I mean right here. This top hole, not none of these. You're not going through none of those. You can, I mean, if you want to, I'm going to show you all that. But uh, you would go from the outside in all the while keeping them laces flat. I'm kind of messing it up a little bit, but keep them laces flat. Big, big uh, key. Yep, there we go. Got it flat. And um, basically, you're gonna have to tuck this. You just tuck that extra lace and you're gonna have to stand on it. I mean, hey, sometimes it, it, you gotta do certain things to, to, to be a part of fashion. And um, you're gonna have to just have these laces hanging in your shoe. You're gonna have to have your foot on top of them. That's how I do it. You know, and it doesn't really bother me. Um, sometimes I put them under my, my insole. Sometimes, you know, I just, Stand, you know, just, just keep them right down on the inside of the shoe, but from the outside in, bam. And uh, you just go ahead and tuck this extra lace that you have here. Normally the laces aren't this long, so you won't have that much lace to kind of be having your foot on, but that is, you know, the tight look as far as that way. Bam, have it like that. So that is the tight way as far as lacing them, as y'all can see. Show y'all that up close. If it will focus, but yep, that is how it looks. And you do have, as I said, you're gonna have that lace inside the shoe. 
So you're just gonna wanna have to put your foot on top of that. That's that's how I do it. I have my foot on top of it. But uh, that is the tight way. Let me go ahead and take these out real quick and show y'all the loose way. Take it out. Take this out. Okay, basically, we are gonna go from the inside out. As I told y'all, keeping it straight. Same thing here, inside out. And now, after I get this in here, I'm gonna go backwards now. So basically what I mean by that is, I'm gonna start with this top, give me a little bit of slack. As you can see, I got this, this, this little bit of slack that comes up there. Same thing with the other side. Give myself a little bit of slack. I got shoes falling behind me. Hold on one second, y'all. Give myself a little bit of slack on nope, this side. Pull it. So you see that there now? I got slack from both sides. A little bit. Just a little bit of slack from both sides. I kind of want to get those even though. Make sure that they're both even. That, that's about well, that's about even right there now. So got them both about even length. And what I want to do is take that slack and work my way down. So pull keep going down and make sure you're keeping your laces flat but just go all the way down so see my next one now that's the next the next area that's that's a little higher now so we're just going all the way down you know giving it a little looser look just pulling it a little by little see see that's where i'm at now i'm at that bottom one so when i get about like right here i don't normally too much mess with this bottom one i normally stop right here and then i'll just put my fingers in the shoe spread it out Spread it out with my fingers. Spread it out with my fingers. And nine times out of 10, you don't even really have to do that because by the time you stick your foot in there, like if I were to just leave it loose like that without using my fingers just now, by the time you stick your foot in here, it'll widen it out for you. So that's that. So now it has that more of a loose look as you can see. And what I do now is I take this top lace, this all this long lace that I have here, I go through the top hole on the side from inside out still. And I pretty much, I'll probably measure it to the top of this, the color blocking right here, the blue. Bam, have my lace go down to about right there. And that's where I'll stop it, let it hang. And what I do with all this extra lace, same thing, if you guys seen any of my other How I Lace videos, I just take this, put my finger right there, tuck it, tuck it. You see that right there, how I got it right there, a little bit back there? Now I just pull it, pull it and tuck it right there. Pull that all the way back, bam. So now it's tucked and that's how one side of it looks. Let me get this other side, do the same thing. Go from the inside out inside out measure it down to the unc blue stop it right there that's my lace line so even on both sides even on both sides and like i said we got all this extra lace left over you're just gonna want to take that lace right over to the same side with the hanging arm um, lace and uh just tuck it put your finger right there and just tuck it back and then once you get it tucked back a little bit, you know, you see you have that little, I'm sorry, right there. You got that little piece right there. You just grab it. Just grab it and pull it all the way in. So we're going to continue to pull it. And you see my lace is going down. It's going down. Pull it. Bam. So now what I have, I have those two, two little, you know, my, what do you call it? Like a, I don't know what you want to call it, but. Two little loops you know what I'm saying that I pulled them in there and got those in there and what I do I just put my foot right on top of those and it really holds it down that's if you have a long lace like I do here but uh, sometimes you don't have this long of a lace you have like a shorter lace that you can just do it and you'll have just enough to have your laces hanging so this is just if you have extra extra lace length you can do it like this but um, yeah, that's that's the loose look. So as you guys can see, this is the loose look, and um, that is how I do it, man. Uh, between the the tight, the tight look and the loose look, 
that's it man so hit it with that gray lace swap as you can see this is how i will be rocking mine y'all let me know down in the uh comment box below did this help you guys out um do you guys dig the the gray lace swap and um yeah man just let me know down in the comment box i thank you guys for stopping through and um checking out another one of the videos man i'm gonna go ahead and hit you guys with that on feet as i promised y'all and um thank y'all again man i hope it helped you guys out and uh yeah that's it that's how i lace my air jordan threes y'all thank y'all for watching gone peace